started getting into freestyle, didn't think it'd be a career path. But to be someone that kids look up to and generally appreciate, it's great to be able to, to be that and hopefully, hopefully motivate them along. So we're on the Red Bull FMX Performance Camp. The idea was to select a group of riders that not necessarily you know, the best riders in Australia, but ones that show great potential. A lot of them will have come across Josh in the past, but I don't think they would have ever had this kind of atmosphere where they can sit here and feed off information that he's willing to give to them. Got a call out of the blue one day from Dave saying, check your emails. Yeah, there was an email from him saying, yeah, you've been selected to take part in this camp. I was pretty stoked to get an invite, so smiles all around. It's basically paradise for a freestyle and motocross rider. Camps like this are, are super important for the development of the sport. That's the main thing, and the development of riders. Land on the brakes a little bit, standing up, brace yourself. We're showing them a whole different bunch of skills and adding to the package they've already got, really. I've got a ramp just around the corner from my place. It's sort of basic, a few dirt jumps, but yeah, nothing like what we've got out here. All the country's pretty flat around tomorrow, so all I've got is a 75-foot ramp and then a 80-foot dirt double, so it gets a bit boring. We don't want them to be focusing on how to turn around a flat corner or you know, clutch and throttle technique. We want them to be focusing on bettering their tricks. So the idea is to, to ingrain them in this sort of instruction over a week and they take that away and learn from it and build on it. They learn a lot about nutrition and training, all about how to stay fit and strong and active and alert. Everyone thinks it's just jumping a ramp and doing a bit of tricks, but you know, when you want to be a, you know, top level athlete, there's a lot more that goes into it. You know, a lot of people might not train very hard for freestyle, but you can be doing your run flat out and not get as tired. You can be more mentally alert because you're, you're healthier and, and you're fit. Sheeny is unbelievable. Hanging with him the last couple of days and just seeing the preparation that he puts into his riding is just a real inspiration. We're going to take you through a couple of activities and uh, give you some adrenaline today. I believe you need to. across this camp was to bring them back, teach them some of the fundamentals they've probably missed across the years and help them evolve that into a you know all-encompassing freestyle run. Overall from their first warm-up the progression has just you know been on a, a gradual climbing scale. The stuff I've learned here is you know couldn't learn it anywhere else. You know I've got the best in the world here teaching it. Noticed a big difference just with the little things that we've learned on the track, just with cornering and stuff. I felt a lot more confident jumping the ramps. Something that I've found growing up in the sport is things are never as far away as they seem. The more they want something, the more likely they are to get it. So if they want something bad enough, they just need to persist and stay at it.